friends so today what we are going to do is we are going to make or draw a toucan so let's see the supplies that we need we need half a sheet of paper uh, markers crayons and something to practice draw on I'm also going to use a pencil and an eraser okay so first thing that we need to do is take our paper uh, fold this like from here to here match this side and this side okay so horizontally I folded it once then I'm going to open this now I'm going to fold this vertically so I'm going to match this side with this side okay now I'm going to open this and then I'm going to fold this and match this side with this line so what happens is we have we can see different lines on this these are going to be a guidelines so I can't fold this white uh, board so I'm going to draw the lines like this one vertical line going through the middle one horizontal line going through the middle and one vertical line in between this middle line and the rest of the paper so so I have all these lines guidelines now watch how we are going to uh, make this to can okay so first we are going to start with um, over here from here I'm going to make a like a J or an L shape okay from here a straight line and then a curvy line like that so you can call it a backwards J or a little weird looking L okay then from here I'm going to draw another curvy line so almost the middle of this paper the middle of here the section I'm making a so or you can make a C C and then connect it to this one yeah that would be better right and then same thing I'm going to make a smaller C like that or a small curvy line and then connect it to here okay now from here this line is there right I'm going to go on that line so this is the beak of the toucan okay over here what I'm going to do is I'm going to make the head so I'm going to make a curvy line touching here now I'm going to draw the eyes and then I'm going to make the patchy part of the eye now we made this part of the eye right and here what I'm going to do is I'm going to extend this make almost a U or a smile here and then connect it to this one okay so we have the toucan so maybe control the legs okay the rest of the bird you can see you only see this much okay the bird is sitting on a branch okay so maybe we can add some leaves so leaves I'm drawing the line and then like that upside down V's or upside down squiggly lines right so this is how we are going to draw the toucan okay so now let's take the paper and start drawing on the paper so the paper as I said we have folded the paper right in the middle uh, horizontally right in the middle vertically 
and from this side I'm going to fold it to the vertical line okay so we have all these folds now I'm going to take my pencil I'm going to start with a from here um, um, this is the middle line from um, a little above here I'm going to make a J so I'm going to make it a little bit like that so when the J is coming instead of going straight down can you see the fold I'm just going a little bit out so to make it belly look more rounded the other one uh, the belly looks flat maybe okay so then next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to extend maybe I'll make a C here okay and then connect it to this I'm going to make another C small C and connect it like that here along the uh, horizontal middle mark I'm going to draw this line got that much now let's draw the head it's like a little rainbow I'm going to draw the eyes a little patch around here or you can put it like this and then make a C okay and then over here I'm going to make a bigger C a little bit bigger let's add the legs Okay, and then sitting on a branch. The rest of the branch you can't see, just like the rest of the bird. You can't see the rest of the bird also. Maybe the wing. Maybe this, I'll make it a little bit smaller, this part, so that there is more space to draw the wing. I think the other one we can make the wing but it's okay I'm going to make a wing for the thing now let's add some leaves leaves on sitting on a branch right so there are leaves coming from all the sides okay so with that we are done drawing so let's um now outline our toucan with the so toucan has uh, once we finish drawing that actually so toucan the beak we are going to draw the beak So this part, the eyes actually has, you can make a circle around here. Okay. Um, this line, if you want to keep, you can keep or then we, I think we'll, we'll just color in here and this, I was planning to color the whole thing orange, but we'll just color in this part orange and then leave the rest white. So I'm going to erase that part. And then it's wings. The legs. 
Okay. So the two cans bake here. You can make a turn it around or turn this way. Make a U. Okay, this much part of the beak is uh, black. So if you are using a black marker right now, I think you guys are using black, right? You can use the black marker and then you can color this part black. Here also like a band it is black okay so then let's now finish with the other outlining You can take the eraser, erase off all the excess lines, like all the pencil lines, I mean. Uh -oh. I'm trying to erase this super fast and then messing up. So Tukan is a black bird with a colorful beak, okay? So some Tukans have like um, instead of here being black, they have red here. Some toucan has um, black. So I just went with the, I'm using, um, I'm just following that black and white toucan thing. Okay. So I'm going to take my black marker. So orange, I'm going to take orange for the week. So um, some toucan has another shape in here, like a shape like this. And that is orange and the rest of the beak is green. Okay, but I'm just going to make my toucan orange. This is one another type of toucan. So I'm just going to follow that. Around the eye also, this orange. Okay, the whole, this part is white. The rest is black. So I'm going to, even if you didn't draw the uh, wings, you won't be able to see much because it's black, right? So I'm going to take my black marker and once you color everything, you won't be able to see the uh, line that you do for the wing. That is another reason I thought of not drawing the wing. But it's okay if you do also. So draw, don't color this, uh, the inside white part. If you think uh, coloring with the crayon is easy for you, you could have done that. But if you have started coloring with the marker, just continue, otherwise it's not going to look nice. So you can see the wing, right? I'm going to make, take my gray marker and color the legs. Okay. So if you want, you can just put 
some more black on top to make it really dark. Now we can just lay it back. So I'm going to take the green. You can take the green uh, crayons because on Martha we have only one set of greens, right? So I'm using two different greens for the leaves and the background. Uh, some of the green is going outside. That's not the way we have to color. We have to stay within the lines. So... Try to color in the same direction. going to go over all the leaves also doesn't matter try not to get on the toucan I'm putting light green for the background for the sky also because it's a rainforest so everything um, the forest is like full of plants and trees and greenery so you are just seeing green all over if you want to make the sky blue you could have done that i just wanted to make it look like a tropical rainforest so it's green everywhere you look so that's why i decided to use light green for the background too green gets on top of the a branch that is also fine i'm just going to add some green okay so that's how our toucan looks i hope you guys had fun drawing this toucan with me um so upload your finished work onto CISO or uh, clever if that is what your class is using i would also like to have a look at what you have done so email me your finished work with a name great um so till we meet, meet next time bye bye